Hey, Collective Hey, welcome back, guys. Welcome back. <clears throat> Excuse me. Big shout out to the entire YouTube fam. Shout out to everyone that has booked a personal reading, everyone that has donated to the channel. Thank you, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate the love and the support, guys, that you shower me with, okay? So I actually have a download today. So what I'm channeling today, Collective, the channel message is reinvent yourself. Holy Spirit is saying reinvent yourself. It's somebody that needs to be reinvented. And actually, yeah, see, you are someone, you've been praying for some sort of change here. There were some answers that you were seeking when you went into prayer here. I'm also channeling for some of you, you got people praying for you which is dope. <clears throat> you have you have people praying for you here, okay? But this is making me think about um I hope I say his name right. Sir Gabbana, is that his name? <laughs> Please do not kill me in the comments, but um the guy that dates Woe Vicky, okay? He was a big rapper. He was a rapper, okay, in the entertainment and the music and entertainment industry, but he recently went through this transformation he reinvented himself okay he served god and he actually just he said he have not released a video in two years okay and he just well released new music in two years and he just dropped the record but it's about him being a godly man about him you know being on fire for god having the holy spirit you know he reinvented himself thank you holy spirit so yeah it's like Something about you collective need to be reinvented. It's a reason. It's a reason. Yeah, see, because you've released the things that no longer serve you. You release the things that no longer look like you. The fog began to clear at some point for you collective. You, you, you started releasing things. You started letting go of things collective. Yeah, because you're walking in your destiny. Or I'm channeling, you're ready to walk in your destiny. You're ready to head towards your north node here. Yeah, we got enlightened. See, this is why you need to reinvent yourself. There are some people that you're going to enlighten here. It's something that God is trying to do. <clears throat> but it has to do with you reinventing yourself. You're going to bring some sort of enlightenment here again this is you walking in your north node you walking in your destiny you bringing enlightenment i'm also excuse me channeling something about your aura something about your aura shines something about your aura shines something about your aura is bright <clears throat> Yeah, we got perception. See, you begin to view things differently. Spirit is saying this is why you need to reinvent yourself. You you no longer you you don't even see things the same collective. You don't even see things the same. I'm hearing your image does not fit your future. Your image does not fit your future. What else that the collective needs to know here? Wow, yeah. This is like the sun card. The happiest card in the deck here. Joy with soulmate. For some of you, this is why you need to invent yourself here. Reinvent yourself. Because you're going to run into your soulmate. You're going to run into your soulmate. And you need to look like a certain individual. Or your aura needs to be shining here. Something like that. Because whatever this is, the God in you needs to be standing out for you to meet this individual. Not only for you to meet this individual, for you to acquire certain uh, opportunities. It's going to be the God in you that attract these things, that attract. Thank you, Holy Spirit. This is why you need to reinvent yourself. Because the God in you is going to start attracting certain things. Yeah, I see some sort of celebration here, collective. Some sort of celebration taking place. Again, this is why you need to reinvent yourself. Hold on, I got one that fell. 
Yeah, we got bittersweet. Bittersweet with wisdom here. This is why it's bittersweet. I'm hearing that song in my head. Um, I don't know. I know Eminem doesn't sing this song, but I'm just, I don't know why I'm seeing Eminem's face, but I'm seeing, um, I'm hearing the old me is dead and gone, that song. Who sings that song? Comment down below. I wish I could sing. I actually hear the song playing in my head. So I see um, you've evolved here as well. Not only have your outlook on, on things changed, but the butterfly here, yeah, you went through some sort of transformation. I definitely see someone evolving here. This is what makes this moment bittersweet for you. Um, I mean, it's because it's like a beautiful thing that you're evolving, that you're growing, right? And then sometimes it's bittersweet because we have to let go of things that no longer serve us, thing of the past. And that's what you had to do collective. You had to let go of things of the past. Yeah, you begin, you begin to use your wisdom here. You began to use your wisdom to help guide you, to help direct you, to help make decisions. Yeah, mysticism. Yeah, because again, it's like, I'm channeling, it's, it's almost like you're, you're going into, it's not really the unknown because you're walking by faith and not by sight. This is what makes this journey mystique. You reinventing yourself. This is what makes it mystique here, collective. It's like you know what you're doing, but you don't know what you're doing, if you understand what I'm saying. But it's a beautiful thing. Again, someone needs to, you need to reinvent yourself because this is going to open the door for some new opportunities for a soulmate here. Some of you are in isolation here with isolation at the bottom of the deck. I definitely see you coming from out of isolation. I definitely see you coming from out of isolation here. Um, you, this is what you did in isolation. You went through the transformation in isolation. See, some of you are in isolation still. Yeah, this is what spirit is saying. While you're in isolation, reinvent yourself. You see the tuxedo here. Reinvent yourself. Change your image. Change your mindset. But I'm also channeling you need to look like where you're going. You need to look like where you're headed. For some of you, literally, your image is going to change. It's just something that um, the Holy Spirit will deal with each individual separately. you know. But again, I'm definitely channeling this is something that the Holy Spirit will deal with you about. If it's meant for you to actually change your image, okay? Um, I'm also, um, some of you are very intuitive here as well. This is giving like the high priestess energy, okay? So some of you could be high priests here, high priests and high priestess. Now one second, I'm actually gonna pull, looking through this book, I'm gonna find, um, cause I really don't know what, okay. Yeah, wow, this means um, the past is obstructed. Reroute, reinvent yourself. Reinvent your self collective. This is a reroute, not an ending. The path is blocked and you're at an impasse, but the goal is still there. Do not wait for your present situation to change. 
stay focused and find another path. You need to reinvent yourself. I don't know. Everybody, again, everybody is going to take this a little differently, okay? But whatever this means for you, it this is what it means for you. But you need, somebody need to reinvent themselves here. For some of you, this is why you're in, you are in isolation. This is why you've been in isolation so long because you need to reinvent yourself. You needed to reinvent yourself the whole time, but you did not know. For some of you, um, those of you that are grounded, okay? Those of you that are grounded, you've already reinvented yourself. Now this abundance is about to flow in. A flow of abundance, yeah. You no longer have these insecurities. Yeah, um, underneath insecurity here, we have renewal. Renewal, this is giving um, reinvent, okay? For somebody, for some of you, you may need to forgive somebody. There could be um, someone you need to forgive. This is holding up your abundance. Yeah, dissipating. The fog is clearing. Things are getting clearer is what I'm hearing, Collective. Something is getting clearer to you. Yeah, we got facade. Something is no longer a facade. Something is no longer a facade here. Yeah, we have miracle. We have miracle, wow. Yeah, some of you have been spending a lot of time with your higher self here with discovery at the bottom of the deck. You've tapped into, again, we, we got mysticism. This high priestess energy, you tapped into this inner knowing. You're tapping into your gifts. Things are no longer a facade. What did I say? The fog is clearing. There is literally some sort of miracle here that's waiting on you. This is why you need to reinvent yourself. Yeah, we got completion. Wow, this is dope. We have completion. This is why you need to reinvent yourself. This is why you keep getting rejected. Spirit is say just reinvent yourself. Then um, I'm hearing job well done, mission complete. You can manifest this miracle. Wow, this is dope. This is beautiful, guys. Let's um, pull from another deck here. All right, let's see. What else is it that the collective needs to know? Unlock the magic within you. Again, reinvent yourself. This is dope. This is beautiful. Reinvent yourself, baby. That's all I'm hearing. See, by you reinventing yourself, Collective, you are literally unlocking this magic within you. We got miracle right here. You reinventing yourself is allowing you to literally manifest in the physical realm these things that are that have been birthed in the in the uh in the in the spiritual realm wow this is dope unlock the magic within you water guardian connect with your emotions for some of you so you could be a water sign here but you are connected with your inner emotions is what i'm getting this could be a, you could feel like you're on an emotional roller coaster actually because you've been in isolation. Things are starting to clear up for you though, but there's still like some something that you're not understanding. Yeah, we have trust your instincts. There's still something that you're not fully understanding or you're not getting or something just is not coming together for you. And this is why you need to reinvent yourself. Spirit is saying, trust your instincts. Trust your intuition.
take charge with authority take charge with authority so if if this says take charge with authority you need to be doing something there's some sort of action that needs to be made see beyond current situations yeah you got to see the bigger picture you have to really understand why god is wanting you to reinvent yourself take charge with authority here and when and when you do it do it with authority do it with a boldness is what i'm hearing see you got to be bold when you when 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 you dealing with god you have to have a bold spirit is what i'm hearing so I'm talking to somebody that got a bold spirit, period. Yeah, be brave and honest. I'm Somebody got a bold spirit, collective. I definitely have a bold spirit. I know I do. I was told that in church one time, like, you bold. <laughs> you bold, but that's always been me. That has always been me, period. You have to be bold when you're dealing with God, baby. This, this which is <clears throat> on the same line of... You know, walking by faith and not by sight. Retreat and recharge. Yeah, you're in isolation right now. This is what you're doing. In isolation, you're recharging. Your mind is what I'm hearing. Your energetic cores. Yeah, we have grow within your current situation. You're growing within your current situation in isolation at this time. This is ultimately the Holy Spirit saying, uh, reinvent yourself. Again, for some of you, literally your image is going to change. But this is something that you need to think about. Hmm, I need to reinvent myself. Yeah, like have a conversation with yourself about this, about this process or ideas you may have. Because you're going to get the answers you need. You have them within you with the mysticism card. You're very mystique. You're very intuitive. Exchange energy to create abundance. Wow. Exchange energy to create abundance here. For some of you, you need to donate or give back. Exchange some sort of energy to create abundance here. I mean, you don't have to give money. Just give your old clothes away to the homeless, to the needy, or donate whatever you can, or um, just something like that. You need to be exchanging some kind of energy here. This is why you need to hurry up. And I'm not going to say hurry up because everything is God's timing. But once you reinvent yourself, okay, you're going to become some sort of magnet here. You're going to be magnetic. You're going to be attracting things, okay? So I'm also getting, yeah, once you, um, once you collective, um, oh Lord, what was I going to say? Once you reinvent yourself again, there, there is just this flow of abundance that is going to come in. Remember, because the whole purpose of you reinventing yourself is because you need to look like um, the season you're walking into. You need to look like this miracle that God has for you. You cannot have a mindset of a millionaire, but still dress like a bum. Even if you're a bum, you're going to find a way to get you an outfit that look like you, you, you are a million dollars, okay? Or like you have a million dollars in your bank account before you even have it. But see, once you become wealthy, I'm not going to say it's like that doesn't even matter because sometimes the most wealthiest people, they dress down. But in this situation, you're trying to attract. You're not wealthy yet. We're trying to get there. So you need to look like where you're going. You need to be able to, um, for people to see you and wonder what you do or just automatically see you and they're going to want to do business with you. That's going to be the favor of God over your life. This is why you need to reinvent yourself, okay? Because God is trying to... Who is it? <laughs> 